Hey guys, Danny Johnson here. My friend Lewis sent me a video about his 2001 Bullet. Uh, his is a black one, so they made 1818 of those. And uh, so it's the two valve 4.6 liter. And he sent me a video because it was making a horrible sound upon startup after it had been sitting for a few months. So he wanted to know my opinion of it. So here's the video of what it was. And uh, go ahead and play along. Tell me what you think it is. So the main thing that sticks out is the puffing sound. And so basically I said, sounds like it may have blown out a spark plug, which is common, especially if you've replaced them. Sometimes if they're tightened down a little too much, it can pop them out. So this is very common on the 4.6 and the 5.4 engines, especially a lot of the heads have four threads uh, in the cylinder head uh, for the spark plug. So uh, if you over tighten it, it can damage the threads. Uh, what can happen is the plug can be in there loose now and on the you know compression and intake strokes, uh, you're having that plug get jostled up and down, up and down, and then finally it just breaks free and comes out. Um, yeah, so especially if the threads are damaged, that can happen. Uh, sometimes it just happens on its own too, and it's just you know maybe a, a poor cylinder head design as far as the threads are concerned. Uh, basically, he said, hey, I looked into it, and that's exactly what happened. Sent me some more pictures of the coil pack broken, because at this point it will... Uh, you know, eject the plug and it's stuck inside the coil pack as you can see down here and so at this point people will pull the whole coil pack up and the plug's still in it and they think oh gee uh, some people not Lewis but others will think that hey it must the piston must have punched the spark plug out now I have a video that I'll put a link in the video description for but it'll show you that the plug sits very far down in here this is on a four valve but the two valves very similar setup but you can see that the plug is way down in there so under normal circumstances unless you were to over tighten that plug and really drive it down into the cylinder head there really is no way for uh, the piston to hit the plug and so sometimes people will even see the ground strap on the plug bent down uh, from detonation and uh, that's you know why they also think that a, the a piston would hit it but it's really not possible. So again, check the video, I'll show you the piston. There's no way it would hit the cylinder head before it would hit the plug in normal circumstances. So anyway, now the question is, uh, what's Lewis gonna do? Uh, they do make some different options, including what's called a time cert, and you basically will tap out the spark plug hole and uh, put a new one in like new threads uh, as a little kit. So I'll put a link to that in the description as well where you can buy that. And with that, you wanna load it with grease because this is a job that you can do with the cylinder head still on the car. Uh, and But by tapping it, you get some metal shavings coming out. So you gotta be careful and uh, as you're putting a new one in. So anyway, check the video description for that. Uh, if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe and check the video description for my other Mustang playlists. Thanks guys.